This is a KC10 split core transformer clamp. They can be found on AliExpress for about $4 US. They come into a lot of different sizes and I chose the 5 amp slash 2.5 milliamp output. Their intended use is to be a transformer if clamped onto a wire that carries AC current. We're going to try it for an unintended use to provide us with a fuel injector parade and an ignition coil parade. I removed fuse number 45 for the injectors. We're going to put this current loop in its place. I show you how to build these things in gadgets number 20 for about a dollar a piece. And the first example that I want to show you is using the Hantec CC65 to get an injector parade. First I want to show you something about the Hantec CC65 current clamp and high sample rates. It doesn't like them. So that's the injector parade taken with the Hantec CC65 at 250 kilosamples per second. So I want to show you the results of that. Very noisy, right? So that we can make a comparison later on. Okay, so to be fair to the uh, hand tech, we're going to uh, step this down here to uh, 25 kilo sample per second. It's going to like that more. And here's the injector parade at that sample rate. Okay, so a bit of noise, and we see the current ramp as each injector was fired. Cool. So next, let's have a look to see what the KC10 transformer clamp can do. So with the KCT transformer, the same injector parade comes out like this. Okay. Look at how crisp that is compared to using the current clamp, right? Next, I've removed fuse number 48 for the ignition coils. Here's our current loop. First with the CC65 current clamp. So the ignition coils first taken with the Hantec CC65. Again, fairly noisy kind of thing, right? Uh, let's zoom in a little bit for some detail. I want to remind again that Fords have a uh, triple strike ignition at idle. So that's what you're seeing here being ramped up, okay? And here's our parade, okay? And that's the detail that we get with the CC65 app clamp. And now with the KCT10 transformer clamp. KCT10 at 250 kilosamples per second. Here's our coil parade. So take a look at this. Pretty cool. Very clean. All right. As the current is being ramped up. Let's have a zoom in a little bit at the triple strike. Again, and what impressed me was how uniform each coil showed up here, the level of detail. I think that if there was an issue with the coil, same thing with the parade of the injectors, with this KC10 transformer clamp, it would show up quite clearly on here. So it's an easy build. All I've done is taken one of these BNC to alligator clip cables. I've cut the alligator clips off, spliced it to the output wire of the KC10 transformer. 
and I've added a two kilo ohm resistor across the leads. So, hope you found this interesting and we'll talk to you guys soon.